My name is Frank, and I am funky, and I am very knowledgeable. Ask your questions, and I will tell you what I think. Oh, and I think a lot of things. You don't even know the half of it. I've got my automobile cues right here, all ready to go. I've got my, uh, my backpack all packed up, ready to go. I've got my... I got my road snacks right here, all ready to go. Yep, I'm going on the road trip. Take myself just cruising down the road. People ask me, Uncle Frank, how many road trips do you go on a year? And I'm like, I just, sometimes I just gotta get away. And sometimes that time is more times than once a year. Sometimes it's like 10 times a year. And I don't care where I go. You know what they say, it's the journey that matters, not the destination. So I just choose a place that's at least uh, uh, 1,500 miles away. That's right, I'll go far. And, and the best part about road trips is stopping at the truck stop because they've got all sorts of different kinds of Skittles in their vending machine. You know, I go down to my local 7-Eleven uh, and they got normal Skittles and they might have the sour Skittles. But you go to a truck stop and they got the tropical skills. Yay! I feel like I'm on vacation already. Or sometimes they have like the ones that are all blueberry. Okay, I'll give that a go. Also, you meet all sorts of friends at the truck stop. There's always guys named Big Jim and Big Lars just hanging out, scratching their bellies. And the last bit of advice people ask me, who should I bring with me on my road trip? Should I bring my best friend? Should I bring my significant other? Should I bring my kids? Should I bring my, uh, my aunt? The answer is just take yourself. Take yourself and some good tunes. And it's a good way to clear the mind. Once you're driving down the freeway at two in the morning with nothing but starlight to guide you, you find a, a peace, zen, Serenity is quite calming.